Okay, welcome to our video. Today we're going to be uh, showing how a uh, King Cutter XB model, uh, designed specifically for subcompact tractors, um, can be fitted to a John Deere iMatch um, quick hitch receiver. Um, I had purchased this iMatch uh, back several months ago and uh, been uh, converting all of my implements over to uh, using it. Um, I just recently picked up this XB um, and I'll have a video about that here uh, shortly about uh, unloading it and unboxing it but I wanted to go ahead and show a few of the modifications that I've made to uh, get this to work with the John Deere iMatch. The first is um, on this top link you'll see that um, I had to make a few changes here. One is that the um, uh, the grab hook on the iMatch hitch is too wide so the existing um, retaining pin that's on the back side of the uh, uh, hitch pin here um, has to be removed to even get the, uh, the the grab pin in there so what I did is I removed that piece uh, where I'm pointing to right now and uh, the original piece was a piece of round stock uh, fairly thick and it would hit up on the back of the pin there so I needed a little bit more clearance so I grabbed from my scrap pile uh, a little piece of square stock uh, just hollow tube um, it was about the perfect size to fit the bolt through um, so I just reused the existing bolt took the round stock out and replaced it with that uh, square tube there and that just acts as a spacer uh, for those two pieces should be strong enough I don't anticipate any issues with that um, but I'll certainly report back if I, I, if I do run into any problems you can see here my dog is uh, licking off the fluid film um, I had uh, sprayed a little bit of that on to uh, some of this to prevent corrosion. It's been raining, so uh, 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 my dog loves that stuff. Don't know why. It's non-toxic, though. All right, so here you can see the width of the uh, XB is um, about 4 inches short. Uh, with the pins, it's about 2 inches short. Um, it's a 20-inch 20, 20 inch width. Um, so obviously these pins need to get extended to fit on the um, iMatch hitch. And of course you're moving from a Category 1 pin up to a Category 3 pin here. So you'll notice I, I went down to um, my metal supply store and picked up um, some 7 8 ID uh, tubing. Um, just some, uh, something, some drops they had on the floor. And the uh, whole thing cost me about 10 bucks, all the steel, uh, to do this. So I cut the top tube um, for that top link there. And then both these side links um, are using that steel. And you'll notice with the iMatch hitch, um, I do have a little bit of space with this PTO shaft, um, which is great because uh, without the iMatch hitch, um, I would have had to cut that shaft. And one of my goals with this is to... Um, make sure that uh, uh, there's no modifications, permanent modifications made to the tiller. So if I ever want to sell it in the future, uh, it will be uh, factory stock uh, with no modifications. Um, and, you know, as long as it can let me do all the things that I want to do with it uh, while I've got it, um, be perfect, but I want to keep it in uh, factory original shape. So, you know, I could have welded some pieces here and changed out some of this. May may have been a little bit easier, but uh, doing it this way was the way I decided to do it. All right. So we're just uh, taking a quick look at the overall uh, tiller here and just uh, making sure you've got some good shots of uh, how I managed to get this all put together. That width um, right there is five inches. So it's actually adding about an inch to the uh, four inch pin. Um, so overall, when I finish uh, cutting and putting all that together and drilling the hole for the pin, um, it'll be five inches on both sides. And you'll notice it's a little offset to the side, to the right, um, just the way I picked it up this time. But uh, that'll give it enough play going both ways if it's five inches um, in total width on that new pin. And there's my dog licking the uh, fluid film again. She, uh, for some reason, really likes the taste of that stuff. And uh, 
hope you enjoyed the video and have a great day. All right. Thanks. Remember to uh, like and subscribe.